There, throwing havoc to the wind, taking chances. First and ten. They could get another first down at about the one foot. Quarterback draw. Field opens. Five touchdown Aggies. Their first SEC touchdown, and Johnny Manziel carries it over himself. I mean, he freezes a defense with that action of his. Exactly. And you're talking about, ladies and gentlemen, a veteran SEC defensive back in Josh Evans. I mean, he gets him right where he wants. He shakes him, gets to the outside. And look at the block up to the top right. Josh Evans, you have, you have Evans trying to make the play, but Mike Evans, 13, makes a nice block. To Conversion down the field in the passing game. Now you can feel the tempo picking up. SMU brings five. Pass is complete to Swope. He looks for the seven, and he's got the touchdown. 29 yards for Ryan Swope, his first touchdown of the year, 17th of his career. And I just mentioned Ron that SMU's playing a lot of man to man defense. You're going to see his slant route come in from here, and I'm drawing circles when I shouldn't be. But if, once he makes that safety miss, once Ryan Smith can't make the tackle, it's just straight from the end zone. State of the art. Yes. Studio we have it is nice. I like it. Makes Kevin Frazier look good. Manziel flushed out of the pocket. Johnny Manziel's got 15 yards to go, and he scores. <laughs> 48 yards for Manziel. His longest rush of his career and his first ru or second rushing touchdown. And that'll look really good on that big screen in the studio. The spark plug, Mr. Excitement. This is the added dimension that he brings to this Aggie offense that they really haven't had with Kevin Sumlin everywhere that he's gone. He's had a quarterback that just makes good decisions. It's and third down, they need 10. SMU drops eight in the coverage. Manziel feeling the pressure from Marcus Hunt. Throwing across his body again. Touchdown, Texas A&M. <laughs> Uzoma Wachiku, his first catch of the season and his first touchdown of the year, 26 yards. And good to see Uzoma back on the field. A guy that has 12 career through a pick right there. Sure-handed tackle by the corner. This is the eighth play of the drive. Pressure on Manziel. Spins away. Looks. Fires. Caught. First down and then some. It'll be six for Texas A&M. <laughs> 42 yards for Kenrick McNeil. What a job by Houdini Manziel. I told you at the open, in the open, I said this kid, you know, could be one of those transcendent players that just doesn't come along that often. I mean, the strength to get out of that, the awareness to keep his head upfield. I mean, the excitement level, if you're a skilled player of playing with a quarterback like this, he's going to... Mantell again. Tucks it, runs away from everybody. Dips the shoulder and he gets in. The eight yards, he's accounted for five touchdowns. Trying to get the young man from action back in his hometown. Manziel looking for six again. Touchdown, Texas A&M. Watch a coup with his second touchdown reception. It was good for 11 yards. There was a penalty on the play, but it was a free play for Texas A&M. And that's a subtle aspect of... Johnny has all day to throw. Now runs. Throws. Touchdown. Watch it, Coop. Look how long this route takes to develop. Manziel sets in the pocket. No one near him. I'm sorry, he's coming from the outside, coming in. But Manziel is just untouched back there. Four or five seconds. He's able to extend the play. And then Wachiku just continues to work across the inline, getting in the... Molina tucks it and runs. Look at that move. Touchdown.
complex. But guys, I know you yell here, but I don't make much of a cheerleader. <laughs> Here's Manziel. Breaks a tackle to the end zone. Diving! Did he get in? Yes! kid is special. I, I, tell, I tell you, I don't know if I've seen anything like this kid. The, bil the ability and the uniqueness that he brings to the quarterback position. You just don't see quarterbacks drop back and run 40-yard touchdowns like he had on the last possession. A 20-yarder here, as you see, he's able to give great effort at the end of that play. I'm not saying this guy is Brett Favre, but he does have that type of ability to deliver from a lot of different angles. Touchdown! 30-yard strike to Kendrick McNeil. Underneath, Roger Koo, 20, sideline, touchdown! On third and goal, Manziel trying to stay in the pocket, looking for some help. Caught. Touchdown, Texas A&M, Mike Evans from four yards out. when I'm looking for a guy that resembles. 308 yards of offense for the Aggies. Mansell to the outside. Touchdown, AM and Ben Molina. 11 yards out. And your opponent has proven to you that it led to points for Texas A&M. Manziel going deep, has a man, it's caught, Ryan Swope. This may be 80 yards. Put it in the books, touchdown Aggies. Andre, the numbers from Johnny. Manziel scrambling, trying to get to the end zone. He will do it. That's just sweet. That's sweet. And fun to watch. Yards of offense today. And well, these were just but seven of those 557 yards. Nonetheless, very exciting. 135 yards rushing for Molina now. Play fake. Manziel in trouble being chased by Tim Dietschy. He's got the first down. He's got the end zone. Touchdown. Boy, what a letdown by the Ole Miss defense. There's no other way to describe it, Clay. You've got an opportunity. You've got a team coming off their own goal line, a near safety. Third and 20 plus. Kim Dietschy's unable to make the sack coming from the edge. Trey Elston, I don't know what he was doing right there. Third and three. Pressure picked up. Manziel to the end zone. Swope caught it. Touchdown, Texas A&M. The senior, Ryan Swope, putting the Aggies ahead. And it was LeKedrick King, and we've seen him make some key plays for Ole Miss tonight. Ryan Swope making amends for a fumble earlier in the first half. One of the most prolific receivers on defense has a chance to win this game. Penzel finds an open man with Kendrick Williams. In for the... Texas A&M flooding the right side of the field with three receivers and then simply just giving Williams the ball accurately and then it's the yards. 
Pressure comes on third and six. Denzel dances out of it. Tony football. Touchdown, Texas A&M. Fifteen yards. And the legend of number two continues to build. It is so difficult, obviously, to contain Manziel. Just watch the contain down at the bottom of the screen right there. The defender thinks Boyd is 31. He's a very good tackler. Thought he had an angle. The angle evaporated. Here's real speed. You try to catch it. Boyd is a defensive back. He's not a defensive lineman. And Manziel runs right by him like his feet are in quicksand. Survived being miserable for most for the most part by getting takeaways. They don't have any tonight. Manziel showing off the deep ball. Evans in stride. Running away from the defender. Mike Evans, 75 yards. Touchdown, Texas a and or to stop the run by a running back, you leave one on one outside, and Mike Evans is a great matchup if you're Texas A&M outside with no safety help. And when you have a quarterback that can place the ball like this, this is feather like touch. Looks beautiful. It doesn't get much better than that play right there. Yeah, Manziel always walks onto the field. Right here in a boot type of situation. A bootleg like you caught it. Too easy. Touchdown, Johnny Manziel. Second rushing touchdown tonight. A yard short of the century mark. What a turn! What a turn of events on this possession. Oh, that might be the dagger right there that Louisiana Tech could not have. Johnny football right here. Pressure comes. Manziel stands in. End zone. Caught. Touchdown. Thomas Johnson, the true freshman, with his first touchdown of his career. There is a flag driving the Aggies down the field. Redshirt freshman to true freshman. Thomas Johnson with his first career touchdown. Third and 23. Manziel trying to put it into it. Johnny Football with a night to remember. Touchdown, Texas A&M. Seventy-seven with that seventy-two yard run. Manziel is going to give the impression he's going that direction all the while. This is the point of attack. Very well disguised, but even better executed. And when you have speed like that, you just need a little crease, and he can take up the distance. Wow. It's incumbent to start fast versus this offensive end. Ninth play of the drive, play fake on the run. Manziel to the end zone, touchdown. Ryan Swope. The senior receiver with a 16 yard touchdown reception and an impressive opening drive. Lined up over on the left side of their offensive formation. Manziel sprinting out. He's going to keep it. Nobody stops him. Touchdown. Johnny Football takes it in. It just opens up a rush lane for Ben Molina. Manziel complete to Swope. He escapes and dives into the end zone. Another Texas A&M touchdown. Mm -hmm. On that overload set. Manziel trying to time, rolling out, flag down. Manziel's going to try and run for the pylon, reaches out, and got it. What an athletic play by Johnny Manziel. There mm -hmm. recently probably... been his knee touching down. Before that ball advances, and all it has
has to do is break the front edge of the plane. It's hard to see because the line judge is obscuring it on that view. But you see Johnny Manziel extending it with his left arm. It looks to me like the ball crossed the front edge this week. He was held out of the end zone. No passes, no rushes. After a ruling on the field stands, touchdown. It's a touchdown for Texas A&M. Cliff Kingsbury. Might as well have just kicked off to him. Swope, 140 yards receiving, and now another first down run, and an easy touchdown for Johnny Manziel. As this is becoming embarrassing for the Auburn Tigers. Here and 350 yards. Cliff Kingsbury having someone very good. So far, can they pick up 10 more? Manziel, all day to throw, and now he's going to tuck it, and he's going to get the first down and a bunch more. Manziel still on the run. He'll score. Touchdown, Aggies. 37-yard run by Johnny Manziel. Well, I talked about the balance. Do you play man or do you play zone? If you play man, all these defenders are going to be running with receivers, and everybody turns their back to the quarterback. And so if he gets past the line of scrimmage, there's nobody that sees him. And there's nobody that's able to tackle him in the open field. And the longest run allowed by Miss, who is kind of, I don't know, he sh shocked me, even though I've seen him on TV. I haven't seen him in person. And now he just cruises in for another touchdown. A seven-yard touchdown run by Manziel. Well, I'm going to say it again. I'm, I'm intrigued. As we take a look at the replay, little lead option. They cover the pitch man. They don't get to the quarterback. That's because the right tackle, Jake Matthews, is able to get. Snap from Patrick Lewis. Four-man Alabama rush. Got him. No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Oh, my gracious. Yep. How about that? Can't teach that, can you? And you can't defend that. When you have an opportunity to sack the quarterback, that's a... Well, Vern, when you have an opportunity to stop a playmaker like Manziel, you got to get him. And this time, Alabama, oh, oh, look, at almost a fumble of the ball. That's what kind of threw everybody off on the play. He almost loses it, re-catches it, and keeps his wits about him. And that's why people have been asking me who he most reminds me of. He reminds me of a Ty Detmer back in his day when he used to make those scramble plays. This ball game and a beautiful pass from Johnny Manziel. Stunts defensively. Manziel comes left side. Ball wobbles. It's caught. Touchdown. Malcolm Kennedy. Play calling in those back-to-back -back plays. Kevin Sumlin did not trust his kicker. He was going for a touchdown. He didn't want to see another field goal try. But those are two perfect throws. Back-to-back -back perfect throws. Nobody back here. He knew where that ball was going the whole time. Kennedy one-on-one -on, -one on the slot. Throw it to the corner. Only your guy gets it or nobody gets it. No safety back there. He had his guy running there with his eyes lit up. Johnny Manziel is 24 of 30 for 253 yards. And his team is on top by 12. Three wide receivers white. Watch a coup to the near side. Manziel straight back. Looking, looking all day. Chase to his right, throws, touchdown, Aggies! Mike Evans. To expect out of this A&M offense is the athleticism of Manziel, and you see what he does here. When he runs toward the line of scrimmage, that completely decimates the defense's integrity because you have to come up and respect his running threat, and when you do that, the wide receivers downfield become open. So again, a four-man rush, dropping seven into coverage. Manziel very patiently weaving his way around. Manziel straight back. Extra protection in, floats it to the end zone. Evans, touchdown, Aggies!
You talked about the basketball prowess of Mike Evans. And you're going to get another really good look at it on this touchdown grab. 6'5", 218 pounds. Manziel goes the other way. One man to beat. Touchdown, Manziel. Exactly how you draw it up in the playbook, right? Yeah, exactly. Running the option play to the right. Doesn't like what he sees, and it's very well defended by the Bearcats, but you cannot coach what Johnny Manziel just did. Not only did he... And Manziel will take it himself. Touchdown, Aggies! His second rushing touchdown of the day. You cannot execute a play fake. He went down to Kerrville to see this young man play. Looking for Mike one to two. He's got it. He's gone. Touchdown, Aggies. 89 yards. Well, Coach Rousey liked what he saw. The AM fans love what they're seeing. An 89-yard touchdown pass. And you could not throw that ball any better than Johnny Manziel did. He led Izuma Wachiku exactly where he needed to be to catch that ball beyond. The five or six plays since he's returned, he's he shown everything already. The stop, drop, and pass. He's run, he's been tackled, and he's throwing a touchdown pass to his favorite target, Ryan Swope, the senior, on senior night here at Kyle Field has another touchdown. The man who gets credit for taking Johnny Manziel under his wing when he first came here. Uh, the touchdown reception there. All is well in Aggieland. The maturing process. The red chip freshman Johnny Manziel. Manziel trying to spit out of traffic there. Nearly caught from behind. Makes the throw for the highlight kind of touchdown. Mike Evans there. And the Manziel show alive and well here at Kyle Field. This guy is when it look, you've got it. Ely has him, and he runs out from underneath of him. He is so slippery, and then the accuracy to come back to a receiver that's becoming his go-to, one of his go-to guys, Mike Evans. Have a serious conversation about playing ball here. Look at the time. Johnny Football still has the football. There's the right leg that time. Gets out of that. Crowd on their feet. Manziel on his feet. Touchdown! Of course it is! Ozuma Wachaku on the receiving end of that one. 249 yards and three touchdowns. How much longer will we be able to enjoy him tonight? Stick around and find out. All AM. Late in the first half. It's a lot of credit for finishing that play. Gaines looks gassed, by the way, and it's certainly understandable. Here's Manzel. A little quarterback draw. Try the right side. Ten. Did he get there? Making it look easy. Untouched. His first rushing touchdown of the game to go along with three passing touchdowns. And if he was the favorite of the Heisman coming into tonight, well, as you end up with your receivers becoming very good blockers downfield, watch the blocks by Swope and Evans. Evans getting away with a little bit of a hold there, potentially on E.J. Cage, but that work always pays off with a guy like this. To, to get velocity on a ball while he's on the run very well. Speaking of the run, he's trying to run that one in. There's your second, there's your third effort. Reached across. There's the signal touchdown. Are you kidding me? That play was stopped, and then it wasn't. And Manziel reaches across for a one-yard touchdown. Make it five total. Three passing, two running for Johnny Football tonight. Play's not over. Uh, you may have been able to call that his forward momentum was stopped, but they're typically going to let this go if uh, 
the scrum is moving and it was moving you know that from the run and also be available in pass coverage third down and nine at the 23 Manziel reverses Manziel with the lane Manziel down the sideline and Manziel still running out of bounds no making a touchdown Manziel tight roping the sideline gets in 23 yards Is they're trying to contain him here and here, but he exits and reverses out. Now there's no one there. I know they'll probably take a look at this, but look at him. Down the sideline and dances into the end zone. Review. They'll have to look and see how he did on the sideline. Bray, Brahe and Jake Matthews opened up a gaping hole. Jefferson has been nursing a high ankle sprain. First down and goal at the five. Manziel rolling. Manziel. Touchdown. When he gets to the corner, they have what they call either or plays, either throw it or run it. Nail off fourth and five. Got to heat him up if you're Oklahoma. You can't sit back. Manziel over the middle. Caught Smoke with speed. Smoke. Touchdown, Aggies. On fourth down. 33 yards. And another missed tackle in the secondary. Watch Swope working to the middle, working against number two, Julian Wilson. He has a chance to tackle him there. It's a first down, but it's not a touchdown. He misses, and Swope gallops into the end zone. And so, oh. lost one up. A Wachaku touchdown. What a beautiful throw. And a brilliant catch. Johnny football. Manziel to watch a coup. Hasn't lost that fire. No. <laughs> Don't think he ever will. Manziel fires, caught inside the 10 yard line. Evans able to keep his balance. Touchdown. Hey now. Manziel's first of 2013. Only 46 more to go to match last year's total for Johnny Manziel. Touchdowns responsible for. And that's exactly what Manziel did. Pump one way, come back with the underneath route. And Mike Evans does the rest. Welcome back, number two in College Station. So quickly, AM from inside its 10 is now in the red zone. A dump off pass to Molina. Able to keep his feet. And Molina heading for the end zone. Touchdown, AM. Molina's at 82 yards rushing. Manziel. Wide open in the end zone. Touchdown, Mike Evans. Third of the half for Johnny Football. And I think Rice has finally gotten tired. This is just a rub route underneath. And they work on the scramble drill a lot at Texas A&M in practice, practice. And Mike Evans, he's just going to uncover. He's not going to be open initially. Just going to keep working, keep working, try to find the open space. And he knows that the likelihood of Johnny Manziel getting outside of the pocket. Walker thought Manziel was going to hit him right where he was. And they were not able to come up with the completion. This one is complete inside the 10. Touchdown, Texas A&M. Yards on the TD pass. Time convincing us that there is a method to the madness, but it sure <laughs> seems to work. 
Into the end zone. Oh, what a Complete grab. touchdown, Texas A&M. Oh, mama, what a play on a 20-yard pass. And what a job. Class act, too. You bet. Well, the Aggies trying to score again and diving. And waiting for the signal. Yes, touchdown again. Brandon Williams. It was all set up, though, by a sensation. Just incredible that he has had exposure and input into the guys' careers. Here's Manziel. Scampers for the TD. Aggies. Six-yard run. By Molina in the walk-off. He's like, all right, enough of this. <laughs> he looked for the receivers. He gave them a chance. Weren't able to get there. And he said, look, I can do this on my own. And felt like he took a hit a little bit. Reviewed it and decided the play will stand. Whoops. Mistake. Well, there's the answer. That's Cameron Clear. This time, no fumble when he hit his back. But how about that for a quick start? Well, again, people have said in Johnny Manziel 101, Manziel bumps, doesn't fumble this time, and he's got an easy pitch for the touchdown. That's Trey Carson, who was in at running back. Cameron Clear, wide open. Five-man rush. Manziel across the middle. Got it. Touchdown. Malcolm Kennedy, number 84. Beat Nick Perry to the left. Nick Perry had no help inside, and he let him get inside of him for an easy throw. Malcolm Kennedy was a did not try to avoid him and go out of bounds. The momentum of the push pushed him out of bounds. Into the end zone, touchdown, Malcolm Kennedy. Well, yep. there's one possession. That's right. But it was a total bust. Again, three down. See how many they bring. Mosley sneaks up. Looks like he's coming. He is. Manziel from the end zone. Deep down the middle. Got a man. Evans. Evans with a foot race. Michael Evans. One man. Sonsari. Cannot stop him. Touchdown. He's the magic man. Down here against Cyrus Jones. Remember, Deion Blue is out of the game. Bump and run all over the field. Puts his hand up, and he throws a strike. He's not the fastest, but he runs right away from Cyrus Jones. I said nice they stiff had, arm. Excuse me, Ron. I said they had to have a perfect quarter. They got a perfect quarter going, and a gift on the fumble. Ends up. Blitz. Left corner, Kennedy, touchdown Aggies! But we're gonna get an onside kick, aren't we? I believe so. On first and goal, Manziel, gonna run again. Walks in, touchdown. They are going through this SMU defense like butter. They're having their way with them. That he could go. It was a Hail Mary completion. 11th play of the drive. Caught. Kennedy. Up the line. Touchdown. And a great block by Mike Evans. 16 yard connection. That time the Freddy just a little early. Manziel keeps. There's his second touchdown run of the night. right now alongside Manziel. 
is where Manziel scrambling can sometimes be lethal. Into the end zone. Touchdown. Evans. And they strike early again. The gridiron on this play. Chris throw it up. Back after this. Blitz. Manziel. Evans. Caught. Touchdown. Houdini does it again. Comes up limping. But what a great effort on the jump ball. I mean, are you serious? I mean, are you kidding? Set here. Manziel. Couple of steps to his left, and here he goes. Trying to score and does. Touchdown. Aggies. Not fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's just not fair. You know why I call that the backyard football play? Because that's what it looks like, doesn't it? Yep, for sure. He just drops back, let those five wide receivers run around, occupy as many defenders. Let him still do some of that. A five-yarder for the touchdown. Scrambles around, scores, and then talking about his standard move. Here's his other standard move after a touchdown. It's 21 to 10. Manziel rolling to throw, puts the brakes on and comes back the other way, and now he's going to run to the corner. Touchdown. Johnny Manziel, a six-yard touchdown, sprint to the corner, and we're a point away from being tied again. Say whatever you want about Johnny Manziel. He's the guy that if you can watch one player in college football play, you want to watch him. You just never know what he might do. That's a six-yard touchdown run. This is stuff you just can't teach. This is an athletic quarterback who has a sense and a feel of when to do this. He felt the backside defensive end closing, and he knew that he could get back around him. Just a, just great vision and feel of the entire field. Think about the two collisions he's taken on this 75-yard drive. One with Brian in there at the goal line with Cody Pruitt, but he just got into the end zone, slid into the pylon. Him one-on-one. -on -one. Maybe nobody one-on-one. -on -one. Auburn brings five, and this is Evans circling inside, looking for a block. Touchdown, A&M. I wish I knew it was this easy. My goodness. See, three interceptions leads the team in that category. Now look at that throw. My goodness, watch yeah. it. Watch out. Mike Evans, touchdown AM. 64 yards. Chris Davis did not realize where his help was inside from Jermaine Whitehead. He's got to stay out wide. He got hooked and maybe held a bit of it. And then once that happened, Evans is gone. But I think the quick throw talked about series on one of those passes he caught. Four receivers out. Manziel goes up, fires it wide open. It's Evans. Goes down. He gets a block. Dives. Touchdown. Travis Labhart with the block. That's the third touchdown catch by Evans. Really close here. Let's see if he touches the line first. I think he's stretching a claws. Stretches the ball out. I think the ball is over. Uh, Johnny said he wanted to stay in the state of Texas. And, uh, Mike Sherman offered at uh, College Station. Manziel, he's got it. Who else? Jeez. Mike Evans. Not only that, they're going to call pass interference, and it didn't make any difference. 
Evans on Jonathan Mincy. Mincy's holding him. He's saying he got to cross that line, too. Actually, he has to touch the line. Remember, he doesn't have to cross it. Four with five, ten to go. And Zell will fall in for the touchdown. Great job by the official to warn Manziel. Yes. Don't do it, I'll throw a flag on you. He got right in his face. Yep. He wanted to talk back. Time called. In goal from the eight, Manziel to throw. Over the middle, pass is caught, touchdown. Darrell Walker with his first touchdown catch of the year from eight yards out. And Johnny Manziel was a perfect 10 out of 10. 70 yards and a touchdown on that drive. Yeah. Sophomore out of Spring, Texas, setting up the Aggies. And that'll be another touchdown. Gonzalez from seven yards out with the reception. And Johnny Manziel with two TD passes here in the opening minutes. So on second down. has Evans, there's a touchdown right on cue. Johnny Manziel to Mike Evans, 43 yards, and it's Evans' 10th touchdown reception of the year and the third touchdown. See if he can get back in. First down and 10. Manziel to the end zone. That pass is caught. Picked out of the air by Walker, his second touchdown reception, that from 14 yards out. Yeah, pretty much the same play as he caught his first touchdown on. A little deep post route, works the back of the end zone. Wide open. Rabhart in for the touchdown. And in four plays, the Aggies regain the lead. 17-yard gain. To the end zone, touchdown, Kennedy. Went right back to him. This Aggie offense starting to sizzle a little. Miner's having a tough time getting lined up. And Zell keeps it. Touchdown, Aggies. His seventh rushing touchdown of the season and the 28th of his career. And Zell into the end zone. Wide open. Touchdown, Labhart. Second down and 10. Pressure coming. Not a problem for Johnny Football. And Zell still on his feet. And he's thinking six. Touchdown, Aggies. A 49-yard scamper for the touchdown. Is, is all the guys evaluating and looking at how his game can translate. Those are the fundamentals you like to see. Into the end zone for Evans. Touchdown. They finally made the connection tonight. Take out the middle. Evans down at the bottom of your screen. Manziel rolls the opposite way. Number 84, Kennedy for the touchdown. So many options in this offense. And no question, and this is what makes Johnny Manziel so dangerous. Pretty good protection. He feels some late pressure there, and he scrambles. You have to stay home, though. You can't lose track of ball thrown against his body. Put it on the money. Running down to the close of the first quarter with Manziel on first down. Looking long, Lampard. Touchdown.
To me, I don't know how you get that wide open. Great time with protection. Johnny doesn't have to set his feet, but Labart's open by 15 yards. Number five's got to do a better job of being able to kick in empty. You got to watch screen and you got to watch number two's getaway sticks. Over the middle. Second TD of the day for Labhart. And then the quick look in to Labhart. Like a basketball game, they can score in a hurry, get plenty of rebounds and turnovers. We'll be back. Back and get themselves off the field or at least force a field goal. Well, they haven't had much help from the offense when they have gotten started. There it is. Manziel flushed again. Finds his man at the 10. It's Kennedy again. Malcolm a touchdown. This is unbelievable. This is where Johnny Manziel excels and is so fun to watch. When the play breaks down, the communicator to be sure Trey Williams is going to be on that tape this week. Bootleg action for Manziel. Dumps it down. It's caught. Touchdown. Ne Nehemiah Hicks. Well, that bootleg action when you got me tying a career high for Johnny football. 44 27. <laughs> you know, Johnny Manziel loves these two minute drills. Comes the rush from the corner. This one. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Cuts right in for the score. No flags. Touchdown, AM. I tell you, John Chavis played man to man to the outside. Mantell hit on a release. In zone. Touchdown, Texas AM. Darrell Walker. Beautiful throw under pressure by Manziel. And that time, there actually was the seams. The ends got upfield, and it allowed Johnny Manziel to step up just... Puts the Aggies back ahead here against Missouri. Now from the 23. Manziel. Got a man. Touchdown a and It's Travis Labhart. I'm going to see Labhart working in the slot just on a corner route against a freshman. We talked about the inexperience in this secondary for Duke. Devon Edwards, he just gets completely spun around. And again, easy pitch and catch. And Evans down here is pretty legit. Manziel to Labhart. Touchdown, Aggies. How about the former women's basketball team practice player, Travis Labhart, with two touchdowns in the Chick-fil-A Bowl tonight? Take a look at the accuracy on this throw. Why Johnny Manziel throws his wide receiver open. You're going to get a wheel route by a slot receiver, Labhart, and he puts this on the back shoulder away from... Second and seven. Mandel leaps over a guy still on his feet. Mandel, Labhart. Touchdown, Aggies. He's magic. Are you kidding me? Okay, this is unbelievable <laughs> on a couple of different <laughs> ways here. Watch the fake screen. They're trying to get. The outside receiver, Darrell Walker, deep down the field, you're going to see just kind of stutters. He's open right now for a touchdown. Manziel missed that. Somehow, doesn't go down, keeps the play. Top 10 nominee, and this had better be number one. Manziel somehow gets away from Kelby Brown and finds Labhart. Touchdown. The Aggies are back in it. Manziel, they'll never catch him. Johnny Manziel, touchdown Texas A&M, and over the barricade, and Johnny's first one back to celebrate. 
And this is just Johnny Manziel with pure speed. He's got a safety, Jeremy Cash, in the box. He's even with him, but Johnny's leaving him. Cash, the transfer from Ohio State. Oh, oh. oh. Well, let's hope the photographer photographer's the okay. Should they need them on defense, depending on the outcome of this drive. Duke bringing pressure. Manziel firing deep. Walker's out there. Darrell Walker running under it. He's got it. Touchdown, Texas a &M. Well, you think you need two scores, so you're in trouble. Time running out. Minute no, two seconds. Minute two seconds, no problem. But look at the air Johnny Manziel puts underneath this football. He sees man-to-man -man coverage, but look at high and deep don't worry about his arm strength dude that's dropping in the bucket too i mean i could have caught that and i'm not 